Well, you know, this has been a hot topic. We've chronicled it over and over here on Channel 4. Building a new Oklahoma County jail close to schools. Well, now the county wants to move forward with a decision on a land swap with Crooked Oak Schools. That would move the school's athletic facilities away from the new jail location. News Force Taylor Mitchell has details. Members from the Middell community showing back up to the Oklahoma County Commissioner's meeting Wednesday, still pushing county officials to drop the chosen jail site. On Wednesday morning's agenda, Oklahoma County Commissioners approved starting discussions with Crooked Oak Public Schools about potentially relocating their outdoor athletic facilities, some opposing their decision. How can you enter into talks or an agreement with the school district when you don't even own the property you're wanting to swap? Cricket Oak Public Schools have plans to build a new sports complex on a property that backs right up to the chosen jail site at East Grand and Southeast 15th Street. Everyone agrees that's too close to the jail. So the idea is, what about a land swap? I'm not a county commissioner. We don't have a vote. My goal is to do the best things for our students. Well, I understand that the Crooked Oak superintendent thinks the jail's going to go there and he's just trying to get the best deal for his school district. But if he were coming to these meetings, he'd know that it doesn't look like the jail is necessarily going to go there. Community organizer Jess Eddy is pointing to rumors that the Oklahoma City Council plans to downvote the rezoning. Community members are concerned and, and don't understand why they're continuing to pursue that when it looks like at the city council they can't get approval for it at the end of the day. Oklahoma County Commissioner Miles Davidson says he doesn't believe they would have to follow the vote because of private property rights. He also thinks it would take a judicial ruling to stop any construction. Not here to split 4-4 with uh, possibly the mayor being the, the deciding vote. So, And I, anything this big, you're going to have people that are against it and you're going to have people that are for it. In Oklahoma County, Taylor Mitchell, Oklahoma's News 4. The Planning Commission still has to make a decision and then the rezoning request would be presented to the Oklahoma City Council. We're told that meeting will likely be in late April. And of course, we'll be following all of that oh, like boy. we have. Yeah.